Hey guys, welcome back to No Catch Name. It's me, Ella. Today is Thursday, <laughs> January 6th. I just looked at it. Uh, we have another snow day. Jesse's school got called out last night. My hair looks bad. <laughs> I was cleaning. Um, they're outside right now playing. I was just taking a picture or a video of them. They're making, De Devin's working on a snowman. Jesse's just playing. But it is snowing like crazy out there for us. I know other places get way more snow than us, but. It started snowing at around nine and it's supposed to snow here all day so we're supposed to get anywhere from four to six inches so we'll see <laughs> but um Devin probably can't go to work tonight luckily he has emergency vacation days for weather so he might have to use one of those I'm making hand soap right now I'm trying to get the rest of this bottle into this bottle <laughs> so I can make it um foam I made one already for the kitchen right there I already made it I got up this morning, I made breakfast. I made a big breakfast because I was really wanting like everything. <laughs> I made bacon and eggs and toast and cinnamon rolls and it was delicious. And uh, folded towels that were already, we washed them and dried them last night and I just left them in the dryer. Um, but I sat down in there and folded them and Devin put them up for me. Now in a minute I gotta go clean the bathroom because it needs a bad. Um, but yeah, I was just standing there at the window looking at them. I wish I could go out there with them, but I know that it's safer for me to not go out there because I'm almost nine months pregnant so I don't want to be tramping in the snow <laughs> but I like looking out the window at them and it's so pretty snowing you can see it just falling down out there the window's dirty but look at the snow it's so pretty but it's also so cold <laughs> our, our high for today is 32 which is freezing <laughs> and uh, tomorrow it's like 28 so it's gonna be cold the next few days so I'm staying home <laughs> I was ho hoping to go to the post office today to get my mail because I haven't checked it in like two weeks. And I know my little P.O. box is full because I got the littlest one. But it's going to have to wait. So I have to film a Happy Mail haul soon because Jesse will not quit asking for hand sanitizer that I got from my uh, Bath and Body Works haul. That I got with my gift card from my mom for Christmas. He loves hand sanitizers and I, and I bought a five pack. I told him I'd give him one after I recorded that haul. So I'm going to do that later. I got that and I got um, some yarn that's, that was sent to me. So I think that's it. I haven't gotten it. All the other cards and stuff that I've gotten are still at the post office. <laughs> so it's going to be a boring haul. But that's okay. But I think this soap is about done dripping. And then I got to go clean the, whew, the bathroom up. And then I'm going to sit down and probably crochet and watch some YouTube videos. I'm going to try to vlog today, but it's going to be real boring because we're going to be home. <laughs> uh, I'm going to make some kind of chicken if the power doesn't go out. I'm gonna make some, I'm gonna layer it mashed potatoes with chicken and cream of chicken soup and uh, stuff it on top and bake it like a casserole. Uh, Cause I have a ton of stuffing boxes I need to use up and I, uh, day for yesterday I got some frozen thighs out and boiled them and took the meat off the bones and it's in the refrigerator. So I need to use that up. <sighs> Catch my breath. But yeah, so I'm going to finish the soap, go clean the bathroom, and then relax, and I'll catch up with you guys at some point throughout the day. Just a little while. I went ahead and cleaned the bathroom up. Oh, that's a chore. It's getting harder and harder the more pregnant I get. I'm waiting for Jesse to get a smidge older and then it's gonna be his job to clean the toilet. 
he's not gonna like that at all but um right now he helps me wipe down stuff but i really want him to be the one that actually cleans the toilet <laughs> but um i'm kind of a perfectionist when it comes to my cleaning so i want stuff done a certain way that's why i'm still doing it because i know Devin bless his heart <laughs> he helps me all the time in so many ways but his cleaning standards and my cleaning standards are different <laughs> i don't know if other couples are like that but um anyways i got my scrap blanket here i'm gonna work on it in a minute and uh I'm just gonna relax. I'm tired. They're out there. They're building the snowman. This snow is more um, stickier <laughs> than the snow we had the other day. And it is still snowing. So they got a really nice snowman body out there. So now they're running around looking for rocks and things to make its features with. And uh, it's just cute. I wish so bad I could go out there with them. But oh well. There's always next year. Yeah, I'm going to sit here and probably watch YouTube videos or just listen to music. I kind of got a headache. I took a Tylenol, so I'm waiting for it to kick in. Um, and I'm going to work on my scrap blanket because that's about the only thing I'm working on right now. I did start that amigurumi, but I have it. I've made its eyes, like the white of its eyes, and it's still just sitting over there. I may or may not work on it. <laughs> Who knows? But yeah, so the house is pretty clean. It need, It's still... Um, needs to be swept i cannot believe how like often floors need to be swept it's annoying i need one of those little robot sweepers <laughs> i'll have to say if i get one of those uh because i just swept the floors yesterday when they were at uh devon's dad's and there's already a little debris everywhere Ugh. oh well i'll have Devin do that later Whew. so yeah they're playing outside they'll probably go in and out throughout the day like they did the other day and uh I'm just going to sit here. I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> it's too dangerous to get out on the roads here because uh, they do salt them. But usually usually our temperatures fluctuate throughout the day. So everything that melts freezes into ice. And that's why people down here freak out because it's not, they're not afraid of driving through snow. We can drive through snow. It's, we don't want to drive through ice. <laughs> and um, that's like that one year, 2010, my mom and sister hit black ice and they wrecked into a tree. And then on the way to visit them at the hospital, my grandmother hit black ice and wrecked into a heel. So when I, when I, by the time I got to the hospital, they told me that my granny was there. And I was like, okay, where is she? You know, I think she was in that waiting room. And she was in the ER too. <laughs> so I, I went to her room to see her. And then I went to the, because my sister and mom had just got there via ambulance. <laughs> um, so they were still in like the triage area. And they were both on stretchers. And my mom's face was bleeding because her sunglasses broke and cut uh, thing right there and she's had blood everywhere and my older brother was like trying to keep blood out of her eyeball <laughs> and uh that's why people in Tennessee freak out over snow and uh, northerners like to make fun of us because they're like oh well we get like four foot of snow every every day <laughs> and it's like we're not scared of the snow we're scared of the ice that kills us because <laughs> we don't have chains on our tires that's not a thing they only sell salt at Walmart when snow is predicted <laughs> You know, we can't just go and buy, you know, we don't have snow shovels. We don't have sleds even, hardly, because <laughs> we rarely get snow. And when we do, it turns into ice, and that's what kills us all. <laughs> and it's scary because um, my husband has to drive down really curvy mountain roads over a big bridge over a huge river to get to work. And so when he doesn't have emergency vacation days, it's scary because he has to go to work, you know. And he has to drive through all that just to get to work. And um, that's why I get so annoyed when people in the north act like our couple inches of snow is nothing and it, it, it's not nothing you know i could drive in snow easily but it's the ice that comes after the snow that we all hate and it's scary and uh we have really bad ice storms usually and it knocks power out here for weeks my uh my aunt betty she lives up on a mountain y'all don't y'all not gonna know which ones but it's the mountain that's that way <laughs> uh they had a really bad ice storm the year i was pregnant uh and they were without power for three weeks and pretty much every single tree and every single light pop there, it still looks like tornadoes went through there because of the ice storm being so bad. And, like, everybody's water pops was broken and, and, you know, everything. It was horrible. It was really bad. They had to bring FEMA and everything in for that. But, uh, yeah, so there's your little tidbit about Tennessee. That's why people freak out about winter here is because of the ice, not the snow. <laughs> I love the snow. I just hate. Mostly because Jess Devin has to get out and drive it and my father-in-law and my brother-in-law you know all the all the people who work outside the home have to get out and drive in it or they you know get in trouble for not going to work so that's why i'm glad that they call school out because then we don't have to worry about getting him back for school even though it's 
literally like a quarter of a mile down the road. <laughs> Luckily, our hospital is like right down the road. So if we needed it, we could just, like if the baby started to get a um, we could at least get to the hospital if we can get out of our driveway. But our driveway, we live at like a cul-de-sac. And um, <clears throat> it's a very steep. <laughs> One year I had to like, it was pretty Jesse even. Uh, it's when we lived in a different apartment here. But we, um, I was at the bottom of it and I had to like, fly up the hill and we just slid up the top of it <laughs> but we made it but uh yeah anyway that's my little rant or whatever about the ice down here so northerners think of that next time you make fun of southerners about uh, uh, snowstorms it's not the snow we're scared of it's the ice because when y'all get snow it stays cold and it's snow <laughs> when we get snow it heats up during the day, melts everything, and then it cools off during the night and freezes everything. And the roads are solid ice, and there's, like, no amount of salting will help it. And we only have, our town only has, like, two plows, and they rarely bring them out. And they, you know, they only do that for snow. I don't think they scrape the ice off. I don't know how that works. But, um, it's just annoying when people make fun of you for things that could literally kill you. <laughs> but whatever. Anyways, I'm going to sit here and crochet for a little while because they'll probably be coming in to warm up in a little bit. They've been out there for a while. And I'm going to look out the window and see if they're working on the snowman. This window has rain spots on it too. Look at their snowman. There they are. They're probably coming back in. Look at his long arms. <laughs> I can see his face and his buttons are rocks. They're so cute. Look at him trudging up the hill. He ain't got his ears covered. That kid, I swear. Looks like he stuck his head in the snow.